so here, here's what I don't get. You know, I don't run around telling other people, hey, here's how you need to do things, right? I understand there are different kinds of people yeah. and there are different methods for different, uh, you know, different things going on in the world. What I don't get is, uh, I, I do understand why someone would say, well, I don't want to take a bite out of that Quran, but if someone says, hey, here's what they're about to start. And the, the only real way of dealing with this is to do something that strikes at their religion because that's what the Quran commands them. There's one scenario where the Quran will command them to stop. That's Surah 6 verse 108. But you have to blast away at their religion with something that is very degrading and insulting to it. And that will actually force them to stop. Do you do it? I understand someone saying no, and I don't believe most people should. <laughs> I believe I should because I'm the sort of person who's kind of made for that. Um, and you know what? What I would think, and I think this is how lots of Christians are. Lots, I think lots of Christians are. Gosh, I would never do that, but I'm glad there's someone to do that. Um, I mm -hmm. think lots of Christians understand. <clears throat> I think lots of Christians understand. Sometimes it's good to have a psycho on your side. To deal with certain people that sounds like a catchphrase right there man <laughs> sometimes it's good to have a psycho on your side 